Egypt. It's the same uh, team who did that particular game. Two assistants also from Southern Africa, Zakele Siwela, like Victor Gomez, comes from Johannesburg. And Ntate Suru Patsuane is the pride of Macero, the first Masutu to be heading to the World Cup finals. These uh, three referees will also be on the panel for Qatar later this year. And unusual that a refereeing team gets to do both the Cup of Nations and the Champions League in the same years. But Victor Gomez has uh, certainly earned his way. The first in the mid-60s, this is number 58 in the history of this wonderful competition. And I'm sure not many of the finals before have had as incredible an atmosphere as we have here now at the Mohammed Sang Stadium. The city has been uh, excited all day long. The taxi men have had Widad flags fly, who uh, is in the Morocco squad as well for their up. And Benza waits in the middle. It's a decent looking cross. And now first chance from Benza. Gets the shot in. Strikes the upright. How close was that for Widad? Whether it's properly pumped up in the meantime a look at Mbenza's efforts he whacked it with the right foot straight out in the middle this is an opportunity another right wrong right shot what a goal what a super goal we don't have the lead El Mutaraji he's hardly been in the game he's come up with something special Vidat Casablanca, with a long-range effort, have taken the league. Zuhair El Mutanaji, given a bit of space, look at the distance, look at the power. No chance for El Shanawi. What a goal for a cup final. He's hardly had a look in in these early stages. Got a bit of a bend on it. No chance for El Shanawi. Ex Anderlecht and uh, Club Bruges and of course Mamelodi Sundowns. And Amlud's on the charge now. Jadi inside. Amlud one more time. Here comes Widad looking for number two. Missed by Mbenza. Counter attack opportunity for Abdel Kader and for El Ahli. No foul. Mbenza unmarked. Dien came in a bit late, but he didn't get uh, much of a touch on it, if any, the Congolese striker was an excellent run from Amlud drawing a purple patch at the moment and they will know though from past history against Ahli this is far from over Malul great ball, lovely ball into the penalty area interception another curl in towards the near post This is a little bit higher. Hena, just wide. Excellent opportunity. How close was he? Gets away from the marking. Turns it side. Looking for Mbenza. All on his own. Three defenders. He's still going. Shot wide of target. Corner for Alali. Had a chance and again it's so close on that occasion just flashing wide a goal work Victor Gomez spoke to their best made plans El Shahat and Malul Malul with the left foot delivers towards the back post it's another chance for the goal scorer can he double it Going to be the first corner for Widad. He's boxed himself in a little bit from the set piece here for Widad. Benza with the requisite red hair to the near post. Yasser Ibrahim is dispossessed by Dari. And El Shinawi makes the save. Will Tullin is only two minutes to go. Ball over the top in search of Tao. My word, what a spectacular clearance from the goalkeeper. Diving header.
medium range effort to test El Shinawi. And it goes wide to go. Now with Abdul Kader. Pass one challenge. Looking to beat another. Out wide. This might be a great chance. Malo provided the cross and an excellent chance there. Now on the break. Rena Jaidi. Cutting inside the goal scorer. This might be a late run in here. Saved by El Shinawi. Goal. Mutraji one more time. A second goal for Widad. They've doubled their lead. Straight after the break. Widad Casablanca. Have Zuhar El Mutraji to thank for a two goal lead. And now Pizzo Mosamani must come up with a plan. This was the break from the home side. Al Mutraji got there ahead of Mohamed Hani. He was perhaps ball watching. Followed up after the initial save from Shinawi. And has his second goal. And he is turning into the cup final hero. Point blank range. Uh, Ali for sure. Atiyadala. Now the goal, the hero. Inside to Hasuni, out wide, looking for the attempted shot perhaps. Oh, that's a strong challenge from Dieng. He'll get a yellow card. Well, there can be no complaint. Might be the man to take it, number 15. Jabran just behind him, number 10. These days you can't combine or let yourself onto a wall, so someone's got to make way there. Referee trying to sort it out. Uh, Jalal Dawoodi. And the shot. Some huge celebrations now. After a first half in which uh, Al Ali certainly dominated. Chance for Mohamed Sharif. Defensive work from Dari. Uh, Al Ali. In the meantime, forward goes Dowdy. Out wide. This time uh, nicely cleared by Ayman Ashraf. Tahir Mohamed has possession. Looking for Tao.